I'm Gozelle. And I hoard candles. I don't see it as a problem. They bring me happiness, you know? It's not like they talk to me, but I feel like they're, they're, they're lit up, you know? Everything's like lit and it brings me joy. Oh, two flames right here. It's like a rapper, two flames. It was one of my birthday parties and I remember the joy on everyone's faces when my dad lit up the candle. It wasn't about the cake, it was about the candle. It wasn't a celebration until it was lit. And then they said blow it out and make a wish. It was like magic. A wish come true because you blow something out. Well look at all of these dreams that have come true. Look at all my wishes. I wish, I wish, I wish for more candles. I'm Dion Zell Green, I'm Glozell's sister, and she is a candle hoarder. Knock, knock, Glozell. Glozell, why, why is this candle lit and you're not even in here? She always has them lit and it's just, it's just, it's, it's just blowing my mind that she doesn't get how dangerous it is. The reason why I'm on the show is basically, not to say I really have a problem, because I don't. I have this under control, but it's more like candle awareness. People don't realize what candles can do. You know, like it brightens your day. When you're in the shower or you're in the tub, you can have a candle there. When you brush your teeth, you can have a candle there. Whoa. Of course, a lot of times I'm in the dark because I want to, you know, let them do their thing. You can sleep with candles, which that is, you know, kind of been a problem. But, like when you sit, when you eat, you can light a candle in your car. I stopped doing that one too. But you can walk with a candle, but not too far. But basically the best part is to just, like this, where you can appreciate it. In my candle sanctuary, if you will. She has burns all over her body, and she's still We'll get rid of these candles. I totally thought I would get her a pet, you know, to keep her company, but after looking at her house, there's no way that anything would be safe in here. My sister is, she thinks she's caring and she thinks she's really smart and sneaky because she brought a candle over, but it wasn't real wax, it wasn't a wick, you don't even light it up. I got her these LED lights and, you know, all you do is flick it on. She said it wasn't real. She said, why would I give her this? Why would I try and change her life? Why did I hate her so much? It was like some kind of artificial, like she's like into technology or something because this is like the real, this is like the wild wild west. This is how like Adam and Eve like chilled out with its candles. It just boggles my mind that people don't realize that this is like the original way. It looks real to me. I mean, what's the difference? It caused like a riff in our relationship because it's hard when you feel like someone is the devil and they're trying to undo like your life. Like this is, this is a lifestyle choice. You know, I just, I really want my sister to have a normal life. Everyone deserves a normal life. It doesn't stop you from doing anything. I can get dressed. I, I can function like a normal human being. I just always have to have, you know, like a lighter and my candles. I'm worried about her. This needs to stop. Stop now. Her whole life is just going up in flames. 